Hey everybody, how you doing today? Random Andrew here, and my glasses are fogged right up. <laughs> uh, not exactly sure how this happened, but it happened. Um, I'm pretty sore today. I am actually really sore today, and I wanted to be able to do some vlogging, some more outdoor RC stuff, or a little bit more on the RC track. But, let me explain something to you. I've been working on that job site with Jay, learning a little bit more about how a house is built, as well as at the same time getting the chance to make uh, some extra RC stuff, or to get some extra RC stuff. And uh, I'll tell you right now, I'll let you know what I'm working towards right now. I'm going to tell you guys ahead of time. I know you sh usually I like to surprise you guys with this kind of stuff, but I wanted to tell you guys this. So maybe you guys might be able to give me some input right now. He has uh, for me, and I'm pretty sure I'm, I'm, this is what I'm working towards. If not, uh, there's a bunch of other stuff he has that I'm really interested in. Don't worry about the other stuff. The main thing I'm trying to work towards is a Losi SCE, no, SCTE 10. So that was short course truck electric 10 scale. And it's 4x4. Uh, the pictures I've seen, it looks a lot like a Traxxas. I mean, I just I googled it and I looked it up. Looks a lot like a Traxxas 4x4 slash, but way better built. The way this thing goes together looks like it's uh, it's going to have some more potential. And I've never had low C, I've never had anything but Traxxas and one Arma. So I'm really thinking about going that direction. Low C. Plus this is going to be able to be run at, uh, there's some, I found out there's local tracks. Jay knows these local tracks, uh, Otterville and the Barnyard. So if I had a truck like this, I could run it out there. I could actually compete, go in the races, run the track. That would be something really cool in the vlog. Let me know if you want if you want to check that out. I may need even even need help from one of my local subscribers. If you guys want to partake in it, be in the vlog and come out and check out what an RC racetrack's like. I haven't even been out there yet, so I would love I would absolutely love to go out and see what this is all about. It sounds like it's a lot of fun according to what Jay has said. Uh, he's been there. He's, he's raced out there, so strong recommendation from him. But back to what I was saying about being sore. I am sore as hell, and I've probably got to go do this all again tomorrow. I'm not used to doing this. This isn't like I'm not usually supposed to be doing this kind of work. Uh, physical labor, it's never really been something I've been good at, but at the same time, I'm also learning, and yeah, I could go in circles about this. But it's just going to be a short update vlog, uh, probably mostly unedited, kind of a back, a throwback to the original style of vlogging I started with. But I'm tired, guys. I'm really tired. It's already nighttime. I didn't get a chance to record anything all day. So I'm just going to leave it at that. Uh, oh, there is something I can show you guys today. Check this out. Now, I didn't do a mail time. See, mail time opening on the channel because well it's only one package empty okay. I'm tired <laughs> Acer Racing there's my summit bearing kit that I've been waiting for I got some stickers with it and this is their business card. Oh, she's holding a bearing? I just noticed that. I think she's wearing a black tutu, black fuzzy wings. This is their business card. <laughs> yeah, she's cute, but uh, she's probably got expensive taste. Anyhow, yeah. Acer World Racing. You can find them on Instagram. You can find them on Facebook. No, this is not a paid endorsement of any kind. So it just says, uh, I don't know if you can read that, it says, we love our customers. If you love us and our products too, we have a few suggestions. Tell your friends and family, write a positive review online, or spread the word of, uh, on your favorite forum. Connect with us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Oh, come on, guys, what about, what about YouTube? What about YouTube? Order from 24-7. Uh, I just ordered these like last week or the week before, so they didn't actually take that long to show up. And the more I look at this person, she looks very familiar. I don't know why. 
I, sh I wouldn't possibly know it from a hole in the ground. I mean, they're what? These guys are out of LA, I think? Yeah. Acer Racing. Check them out. You never know what you might find on there. We'll be getting those slowly installed into the summit. And the summit will be that much closer. I think the only thing holding me back is uh, the spring rests for the bottom of the suspension all the way around. Um, this bearing kit. A couple tiny little almost insignificant pieces for the differential. And a radio. So really not much holding it back. We are going to have it finished soon. And a special shout out right now because I've been wanting to do this for a while and I don't know if, I, I don't know if you're watching my vlogs. You are busy as hell, but you're not a huge YouTuber. You're a big YouTuber, but you're not huge yet. So, Garrett Mitchell, thank you for watching, buddy, if you're watching this. Thanks, I appreciate it. Sure, we, we don't got a Leroy the Savage and yeah, we don't go to the track as much as you, but if you're actually watching, that would mean an incredible amount to me. He's a... Those of you who don't know, Cletus McFarland, do it for Dale, let her rip, tater chip, that's who I'm talking about. <laughs> but yeah, if you don't know Cletus McFarland, maybe you should go over to that YouTube channel and check it out right now before they get much more done to Leroy. There's crazy stuff going on that channel, so check out Cletus McFarland. Um, I want to build a scale model of Leroy the Savage. Uh, I think I mentioned that a while ago, but... Yeah, check that out and let me know if you think I could build a scale model of Cletus's The Roar of the Savage. Anyhow, this is going on forever. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you liked the vlog. I hope your day was awesome. I hope you're not as exhausted feeling as I am right now because it's not very fun at all. Thanks for watching. You guys are amazing. Always tuning in. You You guys rock. Stay positive, no. Think positive, stay positive. Keep a smile on your face, and we'll see you here tomorrow. Good night. Vlog over.